Now here we see the kidney. The outer part is the cortex. And we can see the different colour in the medullary pyramids. Just here. In the middle, this is the fibrous tissue that composes the calyces. In here. Now, if we could but see it, if our eyes were good enough or we had microscopic capacity on this video, we would see that the renal corpuscles, the glomeruli, the Bowman's capsules were arranged around the outer part of the kidney and the cortex and the loops would dip down into the medullary pyramids. Now I've got another sample, in case you're wondering these are pig's kidneys, they're not human. But pig's kidneys are remarkably similar to humans. Now here I've half dissected this. For example here, this is the entrance of the ureter into the internal calyceal structure. And what we see here is these are the apices, the apex of the medullary pyramids. And again, if we could see it, we would see the small tubules, the end part of the collecting ducts coming out in these renal papillae, delivering the urine. And I think you can see on this one, for example, we have the tip of the renal medullary pyramid here. There's another one just there. And the urine's coming out of here and collecting in this space here, which of course in life would have been a, a space. We can see another one there. So what we're looking at when we look up here is the cut surfaces of the medullary pyramids. The cortex and the medullary pyramids. But as we've caught it here, this medullary pyramid here, we can see the apex of that medullary pyramid delivering urine into the minor calyx on into the major calyces. There we see one tucked in there, look. I could maybe just dissect that bit. We can have a look. when we dissect away some of the fibrous tissue we see another medullary pyramid or the apex of the medullary pyramid you know at work maybe sometimes like you I deal with kidney machines and support patients with acute kidney injury and we have these complicated machines with bags of dialysate and connected to computers and all sorts of complicated things. And yet, in life, it's facilitated with such a small structure, but one of such brilliant macroscopic and microscopic complexity.